Nigga, she in it. Who you getting crazy with? Who you getting crazy with? Mm. That's what I thought. Anyways, hi guys. Welcome back to my channel. Welcome back to my channel. To my channel. Wow. <clears throat> so I can sing. Today, I am going to be showing you guys how to achieve beautiful, filled in, natural brows. As you guys can see, I'm, all I'm wearing right now is some brows. I got a little bit of mascara on and a little bit of, a little bit of bronzer. But today, we're focused on my brows. So if you are interested in watching, please keep watching. Please put your post notification bell on. But before you do that, please subscribe because I need to get paid because I'm broke. And I do all this work and I need to get paid. <laughs> Say no. <laughs> Say no. <laughs> but seriously though, it don't take nothing to like this video. It don't take nothing to subscribe to my channel. And it don't take nothing to turn your post notification bell on. So I'm going to need you to turn it on. And I'm going to need you to do all those three things. Because your girl is trying to be consistent. And I need you guys to see my videos when I upload them. And not have them just be uploaded and nobody's getting notified. Duh. I need you guys to be notified. Like, duh. Anyway. Joey. Joey. She's so annoyed with me. Like, are you annoyed with me? She hates when I have her like on her back like this. She'd be trying to gasp for air and she's like, you're not even dying, bro. Calm down. You're just so dramatic. Anyway, um, I will see you guys over there. So as you guys can see, my brows are super thin. Um, this is how my brows look before I did them and this is how they look after and I'm gonna be showing you how I get my brows to be thick and full and filled in using these products the first product is the Anastasia Beverly Hills pomade in chocolate I love this brow product. The second product I'm going to be using is the Maybelline Eye Studio Brown Eye Liner. I'm going to be using this Anastasia Clear Brow Gel, this Benefit Cosmetics Brow Brush with this spoolie, and also this ABH 7B Eye Brow Brush. I'm going to also be using the Fenty Beauty Matchstick in Walnut and this flat concealer brush. So the first thing I want to do is go in and brush my hair is upward. Going in with the Anastasia Beverly Hills pomade and I'm going to be using the Anastasia Beverly Hills 7B brush. So I like to start from the bottom of my brow and work my way to create kind of like a line on the, on the bottom of the brow and then go upward and just try to fill in the end of my brows as well as I can and as dark as I would like. Um, until I kind of like fill in the middle and towards the front area I just like to get the tail of my brow to be like you know super sharp and filled in once I'm done with that I like to take some of the product off of that brush just a little bit just you know because I want to dip into the Maybelline eye studio gel liner in brown I want to dip into that and I want to get some product out for the front of my brow you guys are gonna see what I'm how I do this I like to go and put my brush upward angle my brush so that it is facing kind of like slanted and I like to use the brush like this and fill in the front of my brows to give it that ombre kind of like gradient brow look and it comes out super natural like this so we're gonna go in with the other brow just you know because practice makes perfect so i want you guys to be doing this with me as you guys are um you know watching this video i want to go back in outline the bottom of my brow and then work my way upward once i fill in the bottom and the middle i'm going to work my way to the tail 
of my brow and then I'm just kind of filling that in you know I'm adding a little bit of product as I go by the way it's not a lot of product I just want to point that out don't start with a lot of product always start with a little bit so you can build on that product and work your way upward and just go ahead and if you see any sharp lines feel free to use your finger you know I'm using my finger to wipe that away and then you can always fill it back in don't feel like oh my gosh if I mess up I literally messed up like three times before I filmed this video because I was trying to make it too perfect and I realized brows are just one of those things that it's very hard to make perfect um, your brows are supposed to be sisters not twins I learned that a long time ago um, so just kind of follow your natural brow shape and you'll get it it's very simple once you do this multiple times you know throughout the week um, practice makes perfect at anything so as long as you practice you'll get it next I'm gonna go in with my ABH clear brow gel and I'm going to coat my brows with this brow gel this keeps the hair um, this makes the brow look more natural because it brings the hair out and it just leaves the hair sticking upward to make it look very natural and next I'm going in with concealer with the matchstick in walnut and this, this flat concealer brush and with this brush I'm going to dip into the matchstick when I um, warm it up a little bit on my hand I'm gonna take this color because it's a little bit lighter than my skin tone but it's not too light and this is gonna be super a super this is gonna be a really nice color just to give it that natural kind of like brow so with this brow you don't have to wear foundation because it's not a, a concealer that's way too light or you know a concealer I think personally the concealers that is like your con skin complexion for doing your brows every day is like the perfect is the perfect one but I'm just using that to clean up the bottom of my brow and just to give it like a nice finished look and next I'm gonna go in with the MAC Cosmetics skin finish bronzer and I'm using a little eyeshadow brush to kind of like um, put it in the front of my brow because I want to make sure that it has like a softer look in the front of my brow versus the rest of my brow just a more cleaner look it just blends better it just looks a lot more natural so so what did you think I told you I had you all covered with all the details all the little tips and tricks all the products everything I had you covered girl I try to make my videos to where it's very informative you guys are able to learn like step by step especially my beginner tutorials because I, I know for me when I was watching YouTube and learning makeup there were there weren't a lot of uh, beginner tutorials like that where people are taking their time to edit the video and to really put all the important details and information that you really need to actually do what you are um, teaching you know what I'm saying so <clears throat> I tried to make this video very beginner friendly very informative very slow paced for my slow pacers out there I'm one of them um, and yeah I hope you guys enjoyed watching please like give this video video a big thumbs up Also, please subscribe down below. Please turn your toast your post notification. Please post your note. Please pop 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 Please, please. Wow, that was very hard to say. I need to calm down. Please turn your post notification bell on so you can get notified when I upload videos and all that and all that. But before you go, please check out my next video. It's gonna be right over here, right over here, right over here. Um, and I post, I try to post every single week. I don't have a set day yet, but I will soon because I gotta get my shit together. I'll see you guys again in my next video. Thank you for watching. And Zoe says bye-bye. 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 Peace.